That's my only complaint. Game Freak, please fix that. I mean, at least have damaged um sprite movements. You're probably gonna have that eventually, but you know, um, I'm just giving you, giving you suggestions. That'll just um put the icing on the cake. That just make me all happy, and that's my only complaint. Anyway, um, this Murko, you have to follow it around because it imitates Petrol, and obviously you need um Petrol's voice to open up that electro electric transmission room, whatever. So we have to follow that Murko and see where um it leads us. Heading upstairs now. And, uh, yeah, as I said, Pokemon Black and White, it's gonna be Beast. I mean, it, it's a bit too techy now, I guess you'd call it, but, you know, it, it could be a good thing sometimes. I mean, sure, higher in City's all crazy and stuff, but I really should not judge it until everything comes out. I mean, I want more landscape areas, like mountains, deserts. That's what I'm excited for. That's what I want from Pokemon Black and White. Anyway, getting this... Oh, a full heal, that's pretty good. And heading down to fall that Murkrow. Murkrow head up here, so let's head up here. And Murkrow, um, password is Hail Giovanni, I get the point now. Anyways, I was saying, I, I want more landscape-ish areas in Pokemon Black and White. Then I'd be a very happy customer, because I'm a big fan of Pokemon landscapes. Like, Route 47, the landscape areas, that made me happy. And, um, Stark Mountain made me happy because all the volcano and stuff. Anyway, getting back on topic to Pokemon Heart Gold, here we are, um, Ariana comes out of nowhere. And she has red hair also, and she wants to battle us. Alright then, let's go. That's cheating, that's not fair. And here comes the bestest Pokemon's trainer ever, who helps me out because he's a nice guy, and he doesn't afraid of anything. Yeah. Boss, to replace Giovanni. Alright, let's see what you got in store. You're not gonna do too well. Alright then, Lance has pink hair, something I did not know. Not red hair, he has pink hair. That makes him different from, ev different from everyone else. So, everybody here has red hair, other than Lance, who has somewhat red hair, and the main character, and the scientists. They all have red hair or purple pink, ha pink hair, I'm not too sure, but it seems like they all have red hair, so... Yeah, that's kinda weird. But, whatever. Um, Alright then, Lance has Dragonite, level 40. That's why he's so good, he has overpowering Pokemon. But Dragonite will keep on using Fly, because it's an idiot. Doesn't even use Hyper Beam, or anything. Keeps on using fly. But what I Oh, come on, don't be Come on, wh why'd you do it to Talon? Out of all Pokemon, why'd you do it to That's stupid. I mean Dragonite's obviously stronger than Talon, but you go for the weaker Pokemon. Alright then, I'm not complaining. Because I just want to get get this battle done and over with. And go lands. But if you did not use fly I'd be a lot happier because fly takes forever to be used. Alright then Sludge goes on blitz in and does nothing. Going to stop now to take care of this uh, Grimer, and Dragonite should KO uh, this Arbok in one hit if things go smooth. Yeah. And Dragonite wins. Good. Stomp takes care of this Grimer, and Grimer goes down. Good. Two KOs in one um, turn, I guess you'd call it. Alright, the next up is a Murkrow, and she only has t and the Ariadne has two Pokemon remaining. Murkrow is one of them. And Dragonite uses Fly again, and will obviously take care of this Murkrow because Blitzen can't do anything because Blitzen's not strong enough. And Nightshade misses because Dragonite's flying in the air because that's how cool it is. And Fly takes care of this uh, Murkrow even though it just needed a Tackle. I mean, a Tackle could have taken care of this Murkrow. So, come on Lance, don't keep on using stupid moves like Fly, it's really getting annoying. But, this is it. Gloom will probably go down to the takedown if things go smoothly. I really don't, don't want another turn um, concerning this battle, so hopefully it's a KO and it is not. Alright then, whatever, Acid. A dragon had avoided it and it goes on Blitzen. Doesn't matter. And, uh, Dragon finishes off this battle and it's over. Ariana loses. She is a horrible replacement for Giov Giovanni. Because she sucks, obviously. Church, you really are strong. All right, and this guy is not important, so he does not say anything. He fails. Okay, and they have bigger plans, which means more annoyance for you. But trust me, I'll try to avoid that for a while. I will not try to do, get involved with, with Team Rocket for a long time. At least for like four or three videos, if things go as planned. 
Anyway, um, this guy, Lance, tells you to take care of the, the electrodes and kill them because he's a bad person. You're supposed to be a good guy. I expected better of you. Come on, what's wrong with you? Alright then, battling the first electrode, getting Blitz in the front because Blitz in it will probably survive. And nothing must show here, just battling electrodes and capturing one of them while I take while I make the other ones faint. And here is electrode number one, which I will capture. Alright then that's it, did not want to show that. I mean it's killing a bunch of balls. I mean nothing much to show. Alright then, that odd signal is finally gone, the lake should be back to normal. Alright then he gives you HMO5, which contains a whirlpool. We will not make too much use of that just yet. We actually need it. I mean, it's mandatory later on, but, you know, we really don't need it right now. And it's long and difficult. Okay, I will keep going. I'm the bestest. Yeah, man. Yeah. Alright, then he runs away because he's a little faggot. Bye, Lance. Miss, like, you're an awesome guy and stuff. And heading back to the beginning because we have to do more stuff. I have no clue what to do. Let me go and plan some stuff out, and I think I have more time, so... Anyway, heading to the Pokemon Center and replanning stuff. Seems as if I have more time to record, so I'll head over here. And um, this guy basically says that this gym specializes in um, Ice-type Pokemon, and yeah, Price is a gym leader. And I'm sorry, this entire time um, at recording, I just realized that I was very loud while I was talking about Pokemon Black and White. So I'm sorry for that. I guess I'm feeling a bit weird today. I don't know why. I'm not really in the mood for recording, but I haven't done it for a very really long time, so I guess I'm recording right now. Anyway, uh, as I was trying to say, I was very loud at that time while I was talking about Pokemon Black and White. I'm very sorry about that. And I, I recorded to uh, Mr. Pokemon's house and gave him the red scale to get the experience share, but the thing is, the recording kind of failed, and I couldn't really show you guys that, so I'm sorry about that, but... Nothing much really going on. Basically what happened is uh, you get uh, the experience share from Mr. Pokemon if you give him the red scale. And the experience share, basically say Fido takes care of the swine up. And um, Talon holds Talon holds uh, the experience share. The experience will be will get shared from 450 in half. So Fido would get 225 experience and Talon would get 225 experience. Hopefully you know what I'm talking about, but basically a good way of training without like switching in and switching out a hundred times yeah and Fido is level 31 at this level uh, Growlithe learns um take down but I do not I do not need that because I've already got a decent enough move set anyway I just need to uh, take care of Amber and replace it with a good move like flamethrower which I'll get to eventually so yeah anyway I turned the battle scene off because there's no point showing like, I really want to cram this, um, gym, other than Price, into this entire video, because I really do not want, um, to spend time on it next time. Next time, I want to spend time on Price and the Lake of Rage, which I'll get more into later on. Yeah, over here, this is really effective, because Thunderbolt will take, like, two seconds of animation time. And right there, it, it didn't take any time at all, so that really helps me out, and... It really helps me out in fitting this in into one video, so yeah. Okay then, Thunderbolt takes care of this Dugong. Both one of KOs. Alright, that's good. And, uh, yeah. Next up is a Seal, which gets taken care of with, a, with the same move, Thunderbolt. And the Pokemon do not move, because the battle scene is turned off. I'll turn it on next time once I battle Price, so yeah. This is actually pretty quick, and that's pretty good. And the Pokemon Black and White, um, when Raikou used Aura, Aura Sphere on the footage, it really went really quickly, which is really good because the animations of Pokemon Heart Gold and Soul Server they take a very long time, and it really ticks me off sometimes because I want to get stuff done quickly, and it really does not get done quickly. And the animations in Black and White, like most of them, don't seem to take that long, which makes me very happy. That's good. Uh, Buzz goes on level 31, taking care of everyone. As you can see, there there are a lot of um, water type Pokemon, so um, not a lot of time for um, the animations, which, as I said, makes me very happy. And here's the very last trainer, and please follow um, this uh, puzzle sort of thing because this is the way to get to price, and I'm trying to show you guys how to do it. All right then, Shelter. Um, 
take advantage of its weak special defense. I mean, it's got a pretty high normal defense, so yeah, take like take advantage of its low special defense. Use a special move like Thunderbolt, takes care of that shelter. Next up is a Cloyster, same strategy with that. Thunderbolt again. Thunderbolt KOs again, and Cloyster is down. One more Pokemon to go, and I'm nearing the end of this video. Take care of the seal with Thunderbolt. Okay. And I guess that's it. Um, Next time in Pokemon Heart Gold, we will take care of Price, and we will also progress on. Actually, we will do more side quests at the Lake of Rage, so I guess I'll see you guys then. Just finishing off this battle and ending in front of Price. Okay, then whatever. Next time, we're going to battle Price. I'll see you guys then.